summer, hospitality students at UNLV were tasked with creating a food rescue plan to address food insecurity in Southern Nevada. The global sporting event that is F1 gives students a chance to showcase their idea on the world stage from the heart of the entertainment capital of the world. Talk about learning from experience. Eight UNLV students spent their summer making sure the leftover food from this November's F1 event won't go to the landfill. It was a very cool experience. Harrison Jones was one of those students. He says the project took a lot of research, site visits, and community engagement. When you have events uh, at this large of a scale, there's a lot that goes into it, and so there's potential for a lot of waste. It requires that extra effort to try and just be responsible. Here's their plan. Food that is deemed safe for consumption will go to community partners like Three Square Food Bank for redistribution. So we're talking about a lot of uh, non-perishables, so things that come in cans that are shelf stable, um, and we hope that they find a new home where they're really needed. Food waste that can't be saved will go to sustainability farms. With the amount of food that could be recovered, I think it could help a, a very large part of the community. It was an incredible experience for the students. They certainly taught us a lot, uh, and so we'll be able to run that program this year. And UNLV is helping F1 in another way. As part of this partnership, UNLV will let the Las Vegas Grand Prix use 37 acres on Tropicana Avenue for event operations, as well as parking on race days. Reporting in studio, I'm Kelsey McFarland.